Happy Christmas Eve everyone. If you posted up later in the day I'd be posted up. Christmas Day, I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, look. We're an American team and we're when an English team at the same time. Look at that. How random can you get? Anyway, up London to go Christmas Eve. Chuck the bargain, show you around Christmas, everything Christmas vibe. I would like to say one thing, because we're the only one on the carriage. A special song for you today. Got a roly carriage. We got our own. We have got our own. We have got our own. We've got our own. We've got our own. We own carriage. I'm not waking up so early, so I had a bit of a uh, late morning this morning because it was a bit of a headache yesterday, so there we go. But let's get this day started and see you up London right now. And this is the Piccadilly line. I wish how quiet it is on Christmas Eve. There's about 10 people got off, so yeah, we'll see how it is when we get outside. Just come on, Look how empty the platforms are, you know what I mean? It's like, enjoy yourself up London, Christmas Eve. I'm going to smoke my way out and see how busy it is outside. See outside the gardens now. There's those famous phone boxes you see about. You did, they did it for tourists. Like you did the phone yeah. saying, but yeah, we're in Comic Cons. We see a few Christmas decorations because it's supposed to be nice around here apparently. And uh, see you further up. By the way, guys, I'll be posting up a few shorts today. So you see a few shorts before this main vlog. Anyway, but yeah, it's the Christmas decorations at Comic Gardens. OMG, you've got to see this. This is so sick. That is dope. It's Doppio Cabana. I've seen it right. That's the. Uh, Perfume brand. I like the. Uh, I like the, um, the, uh, the, the. The outside, the Christmas lights. Can you imagine at night? I must be well sick. Oh, so a little look in there while we're here. In there, just found out. Um, uh, one of the Woody uh, hats they got, similar to what I'm wearing, but Doc and Banner, basically. Two hundred and fifty quid. <laughs> just for a Woody hat. You know what I mean? You might as well wear a sports one. More popular. They've got a Rolex shop here. They've got really expensive shops here. They've got the Opera House just there. The Royal Opera House. That's a nice shop in there, actually. Better off to the Transport Museum. Because they've got a nice shop. They've got a dope, dope Christmas shop. D dope shop there, innit? So it's good sounds there. Let's see how it sounds on those train models. Let's see if they've got a good deal today. Oh, look, this is sick. It's all stinkies up here, look, all the stinky perfumes in there. Yeah. I like the display, but showing about the stinky perfumes, though. Look, that's sick. Look like at the exhibition here, look, it's all 3D. Yeah. You come round, different than the other side. This watch is, this, this is sort of 3D with 1.5 million pounds for the watch. It's mental, isn't it? We haven't got a cafe here. Could do a review, could do a review. We're here to the Transport Museum. Way off to the shop, and the shop is open. And they've got a lot of Elizabeth Line stuff. Got to show you at the window. What's so cool? Elizabeth Line. Let's we'll see how much it is when we get in there. See if it's a good deal. See what they got. Not Lego, funny enough. But it looks pretty decent, doesn't it though? Look at that. That's pretty sick. I think that pair on there is a bit overpriced actually, so I left it. See a dinosaur here in Covent Gardens. This guy's had a massive transformation here in Covent Gardens. <laughs> Box, and we're now off to uh, Forbidden Planet. This is the shop we're oh. This is the shop we're off to. Oh, she's saying, we've got the Avatar stuff in the stock now. Let's have a look around here and uh, see what they got. And the sales. 
time actually, surprisingly. Um, we, uh, three seconds, snow's all that water across the road. Yeah, we've been for Forbidden Planet, we've got quite a lot of books. We've got um, uh, presents that we forgot about, basically. Um, happens. First time this year. Um, anyway, go something to eat soon. I'm not decided where to eat yet. We just up from yesterday. Oh. Anyway, we're gonna check out. That's no know. We're gonna check out Piccadilly Circus. This is where we're gonna show you the tree and see what's around. The knots. We could go Burger King. Burger King, 320 meters away. Not the way I walk. <laughs> I go shortcut. I know shortcuts. Hmm. What an interesting food they got. Deals are. They normally do a deal on Christmas Eve. There's a special deal they do on Christmas Eve. I do a meat free and a, and then a meat run every Christmas Eve. Special deals. Oh, this is a good shot right here. Oh Christ, they do good. They do ball, good ball games apparently here. But yeah, we're making our way. Harry Potter's here. The fear to show. Part one and two. I know the story because I read the book. I don't need to worry about it. There's the buses. There's, the, there's the London buses if you want to see them. This is the old, new version of the Route Masters. That's what model they are. Right. Let's see further down the line. Right, we're off to Burger King, I think. Yeah, Burger King. Uh, Miss Lee Grand Dolls, this is to you. Just to let you know, um, you know I always go to you're trying to convince me to go to Jolly Bees. I'm sorry, it's a bit on the sweet side. Jolly Bees is a bit on the sweet side for me. I still like my Burger King. Actually, Wendy's is number one before Burger King. This is second favourite now. Jolly Bees is a bit of the way down the list. Yeah. Yeah. Grand was told me about this, by the way. It's supposed to be a man on top. Wait, where is he? There he is. Up there. I must have remember that. I haven't forgot about this. Batman on top of the Odeon. Right, let's make our way to Leicester Square. In London today, but we're going to show you here the tree and everything. That's our plan. Because yeah, it's part of Christmas. But uh, we just went to the Fibbinum Planet. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we can show you what we got at the end of the day. Because it was a separate video, that. And uh, also, uh, um, went to the two food cute shop. I'll show what I've got. Might do that end of the video. I might do a separate video. I shall see. But yeah, let's get to the tree. There'll be a few shorts on that. Let's get to the tree and show you that. It's a short vlog on Christmas Day Eve because I'm doing a longer one on Christmas Day. But a lot of restaurants are open here, giving food out. I don't time their things close, but I'm on here for a short period and we're going to leave quite shortly. So I'm going to get my Chris Kringle service today and uh, mass later on. It's a church service. But yeah, we're here. Let's get to the tree and keep it rolling. Keep it rolling. There was music in the background, so I took audio over this. Anyway, we're here at Trafalgar Square. And here is a, here's the fountain, as Nelson's column, as you can see. And the Christmas tree. We've got to get the Christmas tree. The crib's up there somewhere. I'm going to walk up. I'm going to show you the water. It was nice because I hear the fountains. It's a shame I couldn't film the sound because the music in the background was so annoying. But I'm going to come here again. Trust me, I'll come here again. But yeah, look at that view. Look how beautiful that is. Look how picturesque that is. Just look at that view of the Christmas tree and the fountains there. Let's walk up, let's walk up and I'll show you, I'm going to show you the crib and I'm going to show you the tree in a minute. Let's, let's go walk up to the crib. We're getting to it. Oh, there's a pigeon there. Hello, pigeon. There we are. Look at that view of the crib. The donkey there. Mary, Jesus there. They're pointing up. Look at the angel. Isn't it lovely?
There's a bit of history for you. These cannon lions, you see, I made out of melted down cannonballs and they carved them out and they made uh, lions. And this is Nelson's column. It's wishing round to show you the fountain again. And National Gallery is there. Free National Gallery, that is. And the Christmas tree donated. That's a box, but I've about spotted this, guys. Look. How epic can you get an ever changing Christmas tree? That is mental. That is so nice. How nice can you get? You can imagine at night, that'd be sick. I'm going to get some train videos for you as well on the way back. Down here, you've got the old buildings of Try and Cross, the old train stations, entrances used to be. It used to be down here. I don't know if it still is, though. But yeah, this is the side of it. You don't normally see the side. I thought I'd show you the side here on Christmas Eve. Something could be a bit different, I suppose. It's got the old um, British Rail logo. I want to, want to show you that. <coughs> I'm just going to show you the British Rail logo. It's just coming up to it. If I show you something different for Christmas Eve, something different up London. I'm going to finish it off with a train now. There we are. Old style British Rail logo. Oh, that's one of the entrances you can go. How awesome is that? Got like a shopping centre down here now. Or the old archway. Got some new shops here. We've got new shops here. And uh, Charing, this is the only way you can walk from Charing Cross to the embankment. The embankment's where the River Thames is. And that's where we're going to get a train. Part of London. We need to get to Mile End. So this is our branch. I want to show you the old style train platforms. I'll probably show it for you for a change. Look, you get another side. How sick this is. Here's the train. Actually, it's not our train, so we're okay. We want the next one. Is that train go out? This is the district line, only going to Tower Hill. It's epic, you know. I'm going to get the back carriage up and get a good view, a video on the train. I'll be here waiting for us in two minutes. And it's off. There's a one going the opposite way into London. Up this station is Blackfriars.